This video is supported by AC Infinity. Yo, 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 what's good, everybody? I am Bass Drop Keys, your friendly neighborhood Negro. And in today's video, we're going to do an unboxing and set up of the brand new AC Infinity Terraform 7. Now, it's always been kind of funny that AC Infinity does not have an air conditioner, but finally they do. But not only is this an air conditioner, it's also a heater, a dehumidifier, an air circulator, and a VPD controller, all in one. So in today's video, I'm going to unbox it, go over some of the features. Also, I'll show you how it looks inside the app. Now, before we get into the video, you guys know that AC Infinity has been sponsoring me for over three years. I really appreciate them. If you guys decide to get the Terraform 7 for yourself or any of the great AC Infinity products, use the code Base Drop Keys. That will give you a 10% discount on any order at acinfinity.com. Also, I do want to mention that I will have my code for Amazon very soon. If you're shopping on the website, Base Drop Keys is the code. If you're going to be shopping on Amazon, make sure you guys look in the description box. I will put my Amazon code in the description. So no matter where you shop, you will be able to save 10% off any order. Now let's get to it. So as you guys can see, the unit is $699. Also be aware that this is gonna ship out on August the 8th. This is a pre-order. It's not gonna ship out until August the 8th. But as I was saying previously, this is a four in one climate control. It has the AC, the heater, you can circulate the air, and you can use this as a dehumidifier. It is an 8,000 BTU air conditioner, and it will cover up to 10 by 10 by 10 grow tents. Now you just saw me unbox the unit. Check out all the accessories that it comes with. Right here, you're looking at the condenser duct adapter, the evaporator duct adapter. Also in that brown box, it does come with window duct kits as well. So it comes with everything that you need in order to set it up for whatever you're trying to do. Now speaking on that, you wanna use the directions that came with the unit. I'm showing it to you right here. So if you look at this, they do a great job showing you exactly what everything is. And then if you start flipping through the pages, depending on what you're trying to use it for, they show you exactly how to set it up. Because you can do so much with this unit, it will be really hard for me to show you everything that you can do in one video. So obviously there will be more videos on this unit. All right guys, so I just showed you the accessories. You're gonna notice that there also is a collar inside the unit right here. You see me pulling it out. I'm just gonna put it together and then put it on the unit itself. It's pretty easy to do. You just click it together and then it fits on really simple. So now that I have that done, let me show you the controls that's on the unit itself. This is the top of it. You can see it right here. We'll get more into that in just a little bit. Now this is the back of the unit right here. You can see the spot where if you're using it as a dehumidifier, that's where the drain will be. You put the hose right there so it can drain. Now on the front of the unit, you're gonna notice where you put your temperature gauge at. Also, you're gonna notice where you can plug it up into the UIS system. Because if I haven't said it already, if you have the controller 69 or controller 79 or whatever controller you have, you can plug this into the UIS system and control it just like you can with your lights, with your humidifiers, with your smart fans, with your inline fans, the entire AC Infinity UIS system. This AC will work with the entire system. And then on the sides, one side is where the air comes out, where the collar is. Then the other side is where the heat comes out. And there we go. We got the unit unboxed and we got it basically set up. All I need to do is I need to plug in the monitor, the temperature gauge, and I need to plug this in to the controller. So that way we can check it out even more. And then, like I said, depending on how you're using it, that's going to determine which hoses that you're using to do whatever you're trying to do. Just make sure you look at the instruction manual. AC Infinity does a great job of explaining everything. Really simple. All right, so now I have the unit plugged in and you can see that it's turned on now. What you're gonna notice is by pushing this button, you can change how you wanna use the unit. Right now it's on the air conditioner. You hit it again, that's the dehumidifier. You hit it again, that's the fan for air circulation. And then finally, that's the heat. And then if we come over here and push this gear icon, 
You can see that you can change it from Fahrenheit to Celsius. I'm an American, so you guys know I'm using Fahrenheit, but use whatever works for you. And then if you need to calibrate the temperature or the humidity, you'll be able to do that. Just follow the directions in the manual and it'll tell you very simply how to do that. And there we go. That's the simple basic controls that's on the top. And so by looking at the box, you can see the features we've been talking about, the climate control, the smart programming, UIS compatible, balanced pressure, targeted airflow, greater portability. The wheels on the unit work great, by the way. Also, you can see right here, 8,000 BTU. It covers up to 1,200 cubic feet. The unit size is 2141 by 12.36 by 27.12. So it doesn't take up that much room. And as I just stated, it is 8,000 BTUs. And so there we go. I showed you the unboxing. I showed you how I set the unit up. Now what I wanna do is I wanna show you how it looks inside of the Ace Infinity app. Let's do that right now. All right guys, so now we're on my phone. And so just hit the Ace Infinity app, open it up. This is my fruiting tent. Port one is the inline fan. So port two is the AC. You can see that it's on off, but it's a bunch of different things that you can do here. You can do the VPD and set it up to trigger on and off, or you can hit cycle and trigger it that way. There's a bunch of different things that you can do. A lot of you guys probably will just use the auto function where you can have the humidity or the temperature trigger, because if you're using it as an AC, you probably want it to come on if it gets too hot inside your tent. So say I wanted to have it come on whenever it hit 82 degrees Fahrenheit, I would just set it up like this. Whenever the tent hit 82, the AC will come on and have it regulate it itself. So there's a bunch of different ways that you can set this up however you wanna do it. Using the app is probably the easiest part of the whole deal. You really can set it up however you want to, be it a schedule or just a cycle, however you wanna do it, you can do it using the AC Infinity app. But all right guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. Today, we unbox and set up the AC Infinity Terraform 7. If you wanna try it for yourself, use the code base drop keys to save yourself 10%. As soon as I get my Amazon code, I'll put it in the description. Ace Infinity sent me the unit like a week before it came out, so I don't have a lot of experience with it, but you guys know I will be sharing everything that I learned with you upcoming here on the channel. If you haven't already, come follow me on Instagram at the rookie mycologist. I really appreciate all of you. And until I see you guys the next time, Peace, guys. I'm out.